All I want for Christmas is Teddy's a blessing. <laughs> What is up you guys, it's your boy Specific, and welcome back to 10 Days of Blessing! You guys look who I'm with! The dad is Ferra! Dude, finally! I know, I know, We've been wanting to film for a long time. You guys, he was supposed to be in my 10 Days of Blessing back in like 2018. Do you remember? But I didn't live here. No, you didn't. I was like, when are you going to be in LA? Yeah, so it was always like a little conflict because I didn't live here and I could never come here. But, but now I drove an hour and 30 to get to here. To my house. Yeah, I know. He literally drove an hour and 30 to come to me, you guys. But we're here, finally. How do you feel? Today is day three of 10 Days of Blessed. You are my first collaboration out of the 10 days that I'm posting. I was going to say, y'all, I feel honored, but also as he motherfucking should. The Badis Berra should be the first one. I was like, I want the first collaboration to come out as a baker. Yes, and also I'm excited because of what we're making. You, I know you guys are going to come for me because you guys are going to be like, you guys, you run out with ideas. You want to keep doing the same shit. But I haven't done it with him. Yeah. So it's different. So we'll add a little bit of spice. And also, when he brought up the idea, I was like, we need to do it because I haven't had an elote. I had a skite, but I feel like eating it like this is like a different experience. Uh, I'm not you lying to them and telling them you took my idea. Uh, <laughs> okay, wait, for real, for real, let's be honest. <laughs> let's tell the truth. Let's be honest. He had a different idea, mm -hmm. but I was like, what if we film that one for my channel? I know. Like, we were going to make antojitos, and then we were going to make the hachios for him, but we, we switched it up. We switched it up. So that'll be on my channel. But first, we're going to do elotes. We're going to make hot Cheeto elotes. So we have our elotes right here. I swear you've never seen the package uh, elotes. They're like just come like in like the caja of ya todos pelados already. You've never seen We them. went to the store and he's like, well, they don't have elotes, let's go. I and know. I was like, bitch, they're right there. So he wanted them to be all pelados and ready to go. But we're gonna but we have to pelar them. Pelar them? We're gonna have to pelar them ourselves. Alright, okay, so first step, just pelar them. Let's just peel them. We already took a step forward and boiled our water already, so it's right there boiling. I don't know how to tell when they're good or not though. Ah, uh, for real. Oh, yeah. oh wait, no, there's no. We shit. open them, they're all fucking like black and moldy. <laughs> for real, they're not even ready to go. I've never made an elote like this, you guys. The I closest know. I've done to this, ya estaban like cooked, and I just like. And I was telling him, he's like, how do you make them? I know, I was like, how do you make He's like, you just boil them. I'm like, and how do you know when they're ready? Ooh, she has more hair than me. A <laughs> peluda. Hey, this is TMI, but when you eat elote, like, be, be for real. And when you go caca, don't you see the little pedazos? Bitch, like I've never. I don't well, maybe lie. Maybe. Don't fucking lie. I'm the only one that should eat. No, I. Okay, I don't go to the restroom and I'm like, where's the corn? I don't look for it because it'll gross me out. I just be like, get it off the toilet and I'm like, ooh, no. I forgot I ate corn. Yeah. Yeah. It's all full. He's like, nah, no, maybe cool. because I've had perritos since I was younger, picking up their poop grosses me out. So I won't look at my poop. Really? Because you don't be looking at the poop you take. Bitch, why am I gonna look at it? Be like, I don't oh, know. today I had a little bit of Cheetos and corn. <laughs> why do you look at it? I don't know. I just, sometimes I just be like, ooh. Yeah! He's like, <laughs> okay, so everyone's telling us something different. I know. But we're gonna do it our way. Oh, I got us Christmas hats. Hey, but don't come for me. I ordered these on Amazon and I ordered a package. And I was like, oh, like I want Christmas hats for like every collab I do. But I come, they're all dollar store fucking hats. Look, these are all like DIY. <laughs> uh, they're flatter than me before my BBL. I'm not putting <laughs> Bitch, look. I look like Elf on the show. Oh, hell no. I act like you on the show. <laughs> it's already in the back of the video. <laughs> Just chilling the whole time. Wait, let me see this. Hold on. Nah, you don't look bad. It looks good. Ah, uh, you can't even see it. <laughs> you can't even see it. Should I put it on how you have it on? Oh. So nobody's gonna hit me up after this. <laughs> the baddest Santa. More like the baddest balloon. <laughs> so we're gonna do four lotes because we do have an audience behind the camera. Say hi, you guys. Yeah. You, you can't see them, but. Live audience. We're under pressure. I'm scared. Ah. Oh. 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 We're for sure gonna have three. <laughs> No, me and Elote right here. When was the last time you had an Elote? The last time? Ooh, I'm like, an hour ago? <laughs> oh, for real? Oh, no, for real. We just had an Elote. We were at Boiling Grab. No, but the last time I had an Elote like this, like a year ago. Yeah. yeah. There's no vendors here where I live. Like, I know. I remember growing up, like the guys with the little cars, yeah. the little horns. These are all rancios. Whoever picked these good. up were not good. So we are going to... We're going to cook. Does it matter how these little pequitos? 
Okay. Oh! Um, I say let's do like 10 minutes and then check on them. So right now it is 11.20. So at 11.30 you're going to check. But in the meantime, we have to crush up our, our, hot, Cheetos. our hot Cheetos. You guys, there's a hot Cheeto shortage in the stores right now. Ooh, we went to the store and there was literally not one bag of hot Cheetos. Not, not even a small one or big one. He's like, I have some at home. I'm over here trying them, bro. But there might be rancid. <laughs> Try them, are they? I hear like, they're all fucking stale. Nah, they're good, they're good, they're good. We are going to crush up the Cheetos in a Ziploc bag. We each have our Ziploc bag. We're gonna put our preferred amounts into the bags and just... This shit's not gonna rip? I hope not. People always ask me how I get them super crunch. Just pretend it's in a stupid that you don't like. Just like, like crap, get that little bit. Fuck crap. Get that little puta. She was living in your man's hands. All right. <laughs> For real? What if you like bite them through the bag? <laughs> You're all gonna make holes? Fuck crap. Come on, little bitch. Come on, fuck crap. Drop your brother's gringas. Uh, uh, these are her gringas. <laughs> Someone once told me to put them in a blender. I know, then, me too. Have you tried that? No, I haven't tried it. Bitch, don't. I did it, I don't know if I did it right. What happened? And it like clogged the blender. That's what I was scared of. And I was like, <laughs> it was all dry, and I was like, mm. I was like, help? It was like, <laughs> my blender all needed water. <laughs> it's like SpongeBob in that one episode. Yeah, like wow. that. I was like, <laughs> since we're on the topic of fuck rep, uh -huh. have you ever gotten in a fight? I have gotten in a fight. Really? Only one fight once in my life. I was in fifth um, grade. Here's your second one. <laughs> <laughs> For the video. You were in second grade? I was in fifth grade, actually. And I used to go to this. You ever heard of the after school program? Yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh, after school. Know. It's like after school. <laughs> no, an uh, after school program. We were playing soccer, and I remember there was this kid who was just like pushing me around when we were playing soccer. Yeah. And I was like, I want to score on him because he was goalie. And I, I scored on him, and I was, I was like screaming in his face like goal, goal. But I was hoping like rubbing like, it in. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. And I was like, I want him to hit me first, so I have an excuse to hit back. Oh, so you were looking for a fight? I know, only because I didn't like him, and oh, like, okay. he was like pushing me around and shit, and I was like, oh, like, I want him to hit me first. Yeah. Fucking hit me, and then we fought, <laughs> and I got suspended for a week in fifth grade. He was a fourth grader. I mean, funny. <laughs> <you're laughs> <you're laughs> <saying. I'm> <laughs> <laughs> what about you? Did you ever, have you ever gotten a fight? I did. I got in a fight in high school. Ooh, was it one I of those like after school, gun. after school fights? Everybody like goes to, and they're like, no, I do this during class, so everyone was in class. Wait, and it wasn't like a cute like, it was like, bitch, I grabbed the fire, bitch. No, it wasn't. Bitch, it was a whole ass video. People from school were posting everywhere. I did a story time on it like years ago. I'm like, I want to see you. You have it? Oh, I have it, yeah. No, you don't. Yeah. I will not be showing it due to YouTube community guidelines. Literally. You have it ready. It's all, it's like, look, back in 2016. <laughs> <laughs> it was my fucking stupid ass amigas. Are you still friends with her? With them? I'm friends with one of them still, not the other one. But they had beef with him. Mm -hmm. He wanted to fight them. He was like, bitch, you I to fight like girls? Good. Yeah. Well, because he's like another Jota vibe like me. I think he felt like, oh, I can still beat a girl up. And I'm yeah. like, bitch, don't fucking hit a girl. Mm -hmm. So I heard him saying that he wanted to fight them. So then I stepped in. I was like, you need to calm down, BB. And it just started escalating. And then I was already mad. And he was like saying, like, if I want to fucking fuck my baba. So I was like, ugh. Like, literally, I like just experiencing if I was so crazy. I don't even remember what happened. If it wasn't for that video, I have no memory of it. Like, your adrenaline is so high yeah. that you're just like. I feel like once you get mad, you just like black yeah. out. And you just want to like. Dude, exactly like that. You literally black out. You don't even know what happened. That was like me one time. Me and my older brother used to fight so much when we grow up. <laughs> so much. Like, all oh, my scars in my face right now? You see? That's from him, like, just fucking clawing onto my fucking face when we were young. One time, he, like, locked me out the house just to, like, mess with me. Like, it was like a glass sliding door. Uh -huh. And he had my phone, and I was just, like, locked out. And I was like, hey, no, no. I was like, let me in, let me in. And he, like, unlocked the door and, like, ran, dropped my phone, and my phone, like, just shattered. I got so angry. He started like running around the table. I fucking stood on the table. The fan was going. I fucking hella hit my head. No. But I was so mad. I was like, ooh! I fucking go and I started fucking jumping. Shut up. So maybe like even more mad. Yeah, no, yeah, it made me even more mad. But that's like the one time I remember me like being like pissed, like mad, like you don't care, you don't feel anything, you know. It's just. That's what I was gonna say, y'all. He hit me obviously a few times, but like I don't even remember. I just remember having cuts all over my body and shit. He was, was crying onto you. He was, he was scratching me. So I had scratches here. I had scratches on my arm, on my back. Ooh. I was like, I don't know, it's fighting. Again. Cat. He was like, Ree! I was like, ooh. All right. <laughs> no, but yeah, he scratched the fuck out of me. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. So we're done crushing the Cheetos. And now they go on the. Ooh, yours is still need to be crunched up. 
Low key, I don't want to say it was all good. I was no. Fuck like, <laughs> you. Yours too is full on hot Cheetos and nah. they're still formed. A fucking full Cheeto just comes out. <laughs> <I know. laughs> wow, you guys are dead. One time, I was a I was a hot Cheeto for Halloween. I don't know if you remember seeing that. Mm-hmm. I was a fucking hot Cheeto for Halloween, and they had commented on my TikTok. I fucking made a TikTok, my dumbass. I was just like in, in the moment. I was like, I love you Cheetos. I was like, but you give me chorro. Shut up. I hella ruined the fucking sponsorship. Right <laughs> I was there. gonna say, they're like, never mind. I was like, I wanna work with you, but you give me chorro. They were like, you can keep yourself and the chorro. You're gonna go away. <laughs> so what do we do? No, no. Uh, touch him. All right. <laughs> <You're> like, <laughs> The corn's are ready. The now, corn on the cob is cobbing. The corn on the cob is cobbing. I'm scared. I'm excited. What? Oh, Bitch, it's not even recording. Don't say that. <laughs> All right, imagine this whole video is just me and him talking to ourselves. I right, take a bite. Oh, <laughs> I'm like, I don't want to burn myself first. And maybe I'm gonna take a blood bite. Ah, don't care. You did not bite it. I tried. My veneers would fall off instantly, <laughs> so I can't bite it. <laughs> Yeah, they're all there. I'm like, it's good. All right. <laughs> We're gonna put the crema in a Ziploc bag so that we could sprinkle it nice and organized and organized. You know? So, are you excited for Christmas, Louis? I am, you guys. I'm actually not depressed for this Christmas. Well, you were depressed last Christmas? Bitch, yes. I was all freshly single. Can't really have been in a relationship in five years. Five years? Not kidding. Like, ah, uh, two weeks. Ah, uh, not three, three, three. Three years? Mm -hmm. And how do you feel? I feel good. Do you want a relationship or you feel like? I feel like I'm not really looking for one, but if it comes to me, it comes, you know? Yeah. So I feel like when you're looking for one, good luck, Charlie. You get the wrong one. Okay, we need a cuchillo because we're gonna spread it out on the elote first, and then that's how we roll the hot cheetos Wait, on the. I have just the thing. Do you have like a little brush? Yes. <gasps> nah, nah, nah. What happened? You have a little one. This is like crema vibes. This is crema vibes. So now we have. Our lotus. We are going to spread the mayonesa. I got a mini mayo at the market. I told I told him I was like, you have mayo. He's like, I don't know. It might be expired. Not you eating it already? No, it's because I went through it. Y'all, it's because I I have food in my fridge that's expired for like ten years, and all there's in there is Red Bull. All right, y'all. Prey has a really weird way of making elotes. Ooh, you. You said prey. Yeah, we're prey. What's prey? You're blessed. <laughs> <laughs> His name's blessed, fool. So we're gonna start calling him Prey. <laughs> Every time we see him, we're like, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> you guys, Louis' dog fucking hates me, low key. As soon as she, as soon as I she, I know she got old defense mode. Yeah, literally, she was like, bitch. It's because Honey will fight anyone new. Okay, that's a lot of mayo. You sure? It has to be spread all around. Okay. You finished all the mayo in here. No, I did. You know, you guys, this brush. <laughs> oh, she took it all off, flying everywhere. Dude, this one makes it feel official. Fool. I know, you're fucking hella lotero vibes right know. now. Ah, he's annoying. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you say, puta, hota? Our audience is hella talking shit behind I the know, camera. Yeah. So if we don't post this video, you know why. You know why? Yeah. They're probably catching all the whispers in the, right now in the fucking footage. <laughs> if you guys listen really carefully, you're gonna hear them talking shit. <laughs> ah, they're like, no one's gonna fucking watch this shit. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you guys, I was saying, Prey has a weird way of making elotes. So do you guys put butter on your elotes or do you put crema fresca? Because I put butter. No crema fresca, crema mexicana. And y'all know, but he, they, he was hella criticizing the way I make my elotes. I've done it before. How do they taste? It tastes good. What's up? I've done it before too. And how did it taste? Amazing. So now that it's all spread, I say we just... <laughs> I'm sorry. It's that word, fool. <laughs> We're gonna... <laughs> Why spread? We're gonna sprinkle it on. We're gonna sprinkle it and roll it on. Well, I'm just gonna rub it. <gasps> ah, our audience is still talking shit. I know. <laughs> what are y'all whispering over there? We're not giving you guys a lot this. I think mine is not going on as good as praise because I didn't squish mine. Okay. <laughs> Fucking pray. That's my new nickname. <laughs> I really want to know if y'all put butter or crema. I bet audience, butter or crema. Butter. <laughs> <laughs> Three out of one, four out of one. Oh, I feel hella judged now. I want to my grandma. <laughs> Bitch, I've never seen an elotero put shit on like that. It's not gonna come out as good as yours already. That is. <sighs> they are ready. Ah, he's all hungry. He's like, I know. <laughs> now what? So, no queso or si queso? I'm, I'm gonna try it however you want to make it. The pre way. I know, it smells like fucking toes, bro. Yeah. That, that's how much it's cheese, though. 
Yeah, no, that's how it is. Okay, so Cotija always stinks. Uh, right? Ooh, it smells like your betes. It do smell like in between your toenails. <laughs> I'm like, not mine. <laughs> Alright. Look at mine compared to his. Mine's all cute. You guys, the elotes are done and ready. I think they look good. You wanna do the taste test right now? At the same time? Yes. Okay, my mouth is fucking watering. We're gonna try the prey way. The prey way. <laughs> oh, the prey way. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot. Okay, one, two, three. Oh, it smells like this. I guess good. praying worked. This is good. It actually doesn't taste bad with the crema. Like, <laughs> They're all like, where's ours? Like, oh. <laughs> no, that was actually so good. They're like, my mom used to make those. <laughs> Bro. Like, I think like the execution wise, you know, like the way it looks, like oh. the presentation. If it was nicer, I would give it a 10. But like, this is kind of all fucking. Is Yours is too. Bitch, mine was all cute. Yours is already all fucking half big. I know. <laughs> I would rate mine a 10. It tastes good. Like. I honestly thought we fucked up with cooking the elotes. Me too. But they're nice and soft. It doesn't like <laughs> my veneer didn't fall off. <laughs> it tastes buttery, even though we put no fucking butter. And the crema, I feel like hydrated it. Right? All right, we're all doing it's like more, it. It's like more fresh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, are you ready to answer some questions now, though? I'm scared. We're going to start easy. We're going to start with like a little icebreaker, a little conversation starter, and then ice it up from there. First question What was your guys' first impression of each other? First impression. So. I thought you were really nice. You were funny. And I feel like that's one thing that always stands out to me is people's humor. And he had a lot of energy. Because when I met you, we were both chamaco vibes. But like, I remember like- When was the first time we met? No, the first time we met? And I remember, let's see if you remember. Like the first time I said hi to you in person. Yeah. I remember. I remember. He does remember. Because you were there with my friend. And that's how I met you. She was like- Wait, oh. no, that, that was the first, first time. So what did you remember? Wait, no, I remember like the, like, the year after that. <laughs> so he did remember when we first met. No, because when you're No, that's right. When you met me, I had like 9,000 followers on Instagram. Like that wasn't even like like a full like inf like creator influencer or whatnot, you know? When we first met, we went to VidCon, but we had both but you were, passes you were, to go. But weren't you there as a creator that year? 2017? You weren't. I bought my pass to go. The next year I became a creator. Yeah, and I was me like, too. Yeah, it was crazy, you guys. We went to VidCon 2017 as like just like fans of other people and fans we wanted of to be people, there too yeah. and just like Kiki and meet other people we knew mm -hmm. from social media. And then that's crazy. The actually, for, I've actually forgot about that. No, that's right. No, because I like I like I knew of you, but it was like so unexpected. Like you know, because you were just saying bye to Crystal, and then I was just happened to be there with her. I met him because of one of our friends. Oh, you guys know Crystal, but any of my perras in here? She introduced me to him, and then that's how we first met. I was like, oh my god, hi, how are you? And then I remember seeing your guys' TikToks that you guys had made in mm -hmm. either your hotel or ours, I don't remember. Uh -huh. But um, I do remember that. you looked like you were having a great time, so much energy. You know? yeah, I was highlight your macro vibes then. Yeah, that's crazy. crazy. I was 16 then. How old were you? Uh, 17. Yeah, so that was my impression. What about you? Yeah, I would say like the same thing. He was really nice and really welcoming. I actually knew of you. Cause like I knew you like did social media, like I've seen your face before. And like, like I said, I went there like as a, as a fan. So like meeting him, I was like, oh shit, like I actually know who he is. He was actually really nice. It was really unexpected, it caught me off guard. Mm -hmm. And then from then I was like, oh, like he's a good person, especially because you were really close friends with Crystal. And then Crystal mm -hmm. was also really welcoming uh, with me. It was just like mesh. And I was like, oh, okay, like Crystal is really cool with them. I really vibe with Crystal. Like, you know, I know he's a good person. You uh, know what's crazy? What? It trips me out because me and Blessive, mm -hmm. I feel like when we went to VidCon in 2017, there's still so many creators back then that were there that year that are still here now. Yeah. And are so much bigger now too. Yeah. And I'm like, it's crazy because like, like seeing everybody else kind of go through that same journey. Yeah. Because there were so many of us who went, all bought our tickets. Yeah, there was. None of us were like creators and we were all just there hanging out, blah, yeah. blah. And like now to be like featured creators mm -hmm. and shit like that, it's like. It's crazy, huh? Oh, like we manifested that shit. No, literally that's how we good. Okay, we are spicing it up a bit now. At what age did y'all lose your V-card? Like, I still have it in my pockets. I have a real <laughs> here. That's a first. I was 16. I think me too. I was a sophomore in high school. That's all mm -hmm. I remember. Yeah, I was like a sophomore. Yeah, I was a sophomore freshman. Okay, this leads up to this one. What was the scenario when you lost your V-card? You don't have to give like details. I have details. a real. I know. You have a video. <laughs> <laughs> well, I could say mine. I bet you go first. I was 16 and it was in a hotel room and it just it was just ha bound to happen. And actually I never said this online. My other friend was in the restroom while it happened. Mm -hmm. But it wasn't like, it wasn't like a full like session. Uh, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> for real. It just happened for like 
five minutes. Bitch, all quick. I know. All right, have a good night. Bye, I'll see you tomorrow. It was, it was scary. I didn't expect it that time either. It just happened. Were like, y'all dating or it was just like, about to be meta boom, let's get it? It was like talking. Mine was with my first relationship. Didn't you make a YouTube video out of this? No, 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 look. I'm gonna clear that up before people get confused. I have a story time called Losing My Virginity in sixth grade. That was me, like if y'all watch the story time, y'all know. That was me almost losing it. Okay, so yeah, it was like with a girl and there was all this crazy shit that happened. Mm -hmm. But for like for it actually happening, it like was- Like the first time it- Yeah, mm -hmm. like it actually crisscrossed, mm -hmm. went in, backflip and everything. <laughs> that was sophomore year with my first boyfriend. And I liked that because um I had a connection with that person and mm -hmm. like it made me feel comfortable. So it was a good one. That was good. Someone said, there's this girl that wants to fight me because she got beef with me. What should I do? What Shut up she... a bun. I know. Fight her back. No. What I would say is just like, let her have her whole shebang by herself. Mm -hmm. Walk away, do your own thing. I would say like not fight because it's like not worth it. This comes from someone who already got on a fight. But... I know the whole video fucking broke. I know. <laughs> but I feel like what he said, mm -hmm. if they hit you first, yeah, bitch. Like, protect yourself. Don't let her fucking hit you. Put up the biggest bun yeah, you've ever put in your whole entire life and get her, bro. Like, show her mm -hmm. that it was the wrong thing to fuck with you. That's exactly. all I'm gonna say. Like, if it comes at you and there's no way out, just give it your all. Don't even be scared. I ride raw training them how to fight. Uh, no. <laughs> no, but just. Or like, number one. Stay safe. <laughs> no, but yeah, stand up for yourself. Don't let yourself get bashed on. Someone said, I'm getting cheated on right now. What do I do? Leave. Leave. Like, Especially because you fucking know too. Yeah, exactly. Like, it's not even like like it's comments. I know it's like for real. Just like, go. Oh, I know it's hard, but why do you want to be there, BB? Or you can do the perra way and cheat back and don't tell them. No, no. Cheat back and then leave. Someone said, what's the cheese in your love life? There really is anything. It's just more like, I'm just free landing. You're like going about your life. Yeah, exactly. Whatever comes to me comes and nothing serious. I feel like I'm the same. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I've gone on a few dates, but I'm kind of over it. I feel like a lot of it is just, I haven't found what I want, mm -hmm. what I'm looking for. And I feel like I'm at a point where like, you know, I'm looking for something like serious. I'm yeah. not looking to play around. So I'm very much like, if I'm going to like mess around with someone cute, whatever, but like if I'm going to take it serious, I'm going to take it serious. Yeah. But I'm also not looking for it. If it happens, they happen. So I'm it just kind of, happens. I'm happy where I'm at right now. I'm just like going around. Does Blessed feel attracted to the BBL? Mm. No lie, Louis. That should be catching me off guard sometimes. Like, like for real, for real. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all in front of us. Nah, honestly, you guys, like, we be in fucking public. Like, for example, like, I'm just, like, talking to Des, and, like, I'm just, like, right here, and I turn around, I'm like, oh! <laughs> He's like, oh. all right, so that's like, like, oh, <laughs> No, you know what? It's funny when people tell me that, because, like, look, y'all. Or even when I re run into some of my perras and mm. shit, they're like, Louis, the first thing I noticed was your ass. But for me, obviously, my butt is behind me, so I don't know what it looks like, unless, like, I asked someone to like take me a picture and I'm like you. Yeah. But for the most part, like, I don't know what it looks like. So for me, like, I don't even know if it's something that people look at. All right. No, but that's when people tell me that I'm like, fuck, like, I want to see my own ass. And I'm like, <laughs> you're like, I'm here. Yeah, when I'm walking, I'm like, yeah, she looks kind of good. If you were both stuck on an island and could bring three things, what would those three things be? A nombre, water, and. I don't know. I don't know why I picked that question because I don't know the answer to that. Bitch. <laughs> you're like, I wouldn't even go to the island. I know. I'm I like, think those are my top two. I don't even really have an answer for that. I'm gonna jump in the water. <laughs> I like swim away and whatever happens, happens. Someone said, no question, just start dancing bachata. Uh -huh. How do you dance bachata? So, I wanna see how much hip movement you put in. I put a lot of hip movement yeah. in there. I do. I so I go, one, two, and then you have to pop the hip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, wait, you actually know. <laughs> wait, y'all, that's sickening, because I've been seeing hombres in the room. Oh, the kids said, yeah, that's fucking off me. Yes, or they move their fucking cabeza more than their ass. Yeah. But I feel like even when guys like know how to like mm -hmm. move their hip or they go with their girl, uh -huh. I'm like, yes. Uh, I exaggerate. You gotta throw them in the pussy. Yeah. Like, yeah. I feel like bachata is like a pretty dance to look at. I don't know. I've never seen people dance bachata. Mm -hmm. Someone said, have you been having any Chile appointments? I have. Recently? Yeah. Yeah. I'm like. But today. Wow. are you at or yeah. earlier today? <laughs> like, do you feel like it's easy for you to like, okay, I'm gonna like do it or you feel like you think about it and you're like, do I want to? Cause I feel like right now, mm -hmm. before earlier, I was really like easy like to just like, okay, I want to chill up right now, right now. Mm -hmm. But I feel like where I'm at right now, it kind of takes me a little while to be like, all right, I'm down. But, yeah, I feel you. I'm like the same way. Especially for it to be like newer people, you know? Mm -hmm. so I'm like, all right, we use the yeah. same ones. <laughs> no, literally, I got tired of using the same ones. But also like, because I'm in that like, mm -hmm. I'm also looking for a relationship vibe, I feel like that's why I kind of see yeah. that I'm like chill if I'm 
but they still come here and there. I agree. Would you say I tend I, I try not to mess with people like in like the influencer space? Dude, and that's I literally talk about that all the time. I'm like, it's hard because I really only go to like events and mm -hmm. stuff. Where there's a lot of people that do the same shit as you. Yeah, and then like you already know everybody. It's like mm -hmm. familiar. It's really hard to meet somebody new, y'all. So I feel like my chill appointments are never really like well, obviously like in the little industry yeah. it's always like out and about but then it's really hard for me to meet people out and about because i don't really go out and about I agree. unless Same i'm at a here. clip and i feel like the word gets around in the influencer yeah. space right now oh my god like, yes mm -hmm. like literally you tell one person the other and i'm like no, no, fucking no. I feel like i slept with everyone and you fucking know you're on the shade room <laughs> for real <laughs> All right, you guys, so that was the end of this youtube video if you guys enjoyed it please make sure to leave a big thumbs up subscribe down below and i'll be as I was saying before my camera died, that was the end of this YouTube video. If you guys enjoyed it, leave a big thumbs up, subscribe down below, and I'll be leaving all of Louis' channel information, social media down below. And you think the video we filmed is gonna be up on your channel by then? When do you plan to post? It'll be late tomorrow. Oh, <laughs> I feel like mine will already be up. It will already be up. Because he's pre-filming like fucking three months in advance. No, this is gonna be up December 18th. Mine should already be up. His is gonna be up, so I'll be leaving the link down below if you haven't already watched it. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you guys mañana. Bye! Bye.